clock violation just before the ball lead. And getting out to an early lead might be important for a team that's got such a short bench like the Legends. Well, it could be even a beefier lead if they get their two guys who are stretch four type Dirk Light guys going at the same time. One of those guys, Jamil Wilson. Parks puts it on the deck, attacks and kicks. Ten on the shot clock. A minute left in the first quarter. Terrific defense by Iowa here. Three on the clock. Holloway heaves up a three, and it's in and out. Yeah, they earned that. No penetration allowed. Switching, so there was no difference in I got you, you got me. That was terrific. The Legends 2 of 7 from behind the arc here early on. Ennis falling away, can't get it to go. Miller goes high for the board. Makes threes. He's also gone to the line making five out of six free throws. And he ran that possession well enough. Legends just ran out of time, but you know, the, uh, the shot clock violations, two out of three possessions, give credit to the other team. That's what they do. Martin right down the paint, unable to get it to go first time, but tips it in with a second. Murray knocked for the foul there. With that won't show up as anything in the scorebook, except that was that was almost a fast break after a made basket. Jackson lines up a three, and the southpaw knocks it down. So the energy with the lead. They're now up 33-31 in our scoreboard this quarter, brought to you by the fine folks over at J.C. Penney. Legends really working the ball around the perimeter. Three ball, Pledger, a little too strong, but rebound Parks puts it back, and he gets it to go. And that perimeter work is... And you saw the Legends that last possession getting a second chance bucket. They're third in the D-League entering tonight, averaging just under 17 second chance points per game. A lot of that, though, you got to believe due to the athleticism of a guy down low like Michael Eric and a guy like Brandon Ashley. As Wilson knocks down the three, Eric and Ashley. Wilson knocks down the three, Eric and Ashley both struggling, uh, or I guess Ashley struggling tonight. Eric's going to struggle to contribute tonight because he's not available. <laughs> Well, and Eric's a guy who helped you win inside on both ends of the floor. And that's just not available to Texas on Saturday when Rick Carlisle will take Measury and Justin Anderson on the road with the Mavericks. Legends come out in favor after some chaos. Three ball, Pledger can't get it to go, and he's struggling in his home debut for the Legends. Play bad turf toe. It ended Deion Sanders' career. Right now, hopefully he can recover from it, but it will be next season before we see his recovery. And in regards to next season, that overall timetable, is it six months, is it a year? What are we looking at? It's probably at least six months. Dr. Glogow, I appreciate your time. Head on back to the bench, take care of our guys, keep them healthy for us. That's good. Brought to you by the Home Depot. Well, there you go, Martin wow. misses them both. And Ashley secures his eighth rebound to go along with 14 points, three assists, a steal and a block for the All-Star. Murray turning around and knocking one down. Yeah, that wasn't just ball, don't lie. That was, no, they wanted to be the tortoise and the hare tonight. Seen a little bit wide, Jarrell Martin was a first round pick by the Grizzlies at LSU. Miller, Pledger, high arcing, three in the foul! A chance for four for Steven Pledger. Andrews goes high to squeeze the board. Three possession game. Right. With his back to Murray, lobs it up. Andrews can't get the jam to go. Murray pushing, but replay the determined no clear path foul. They did not. Re and it's currently 91 87 energy. It could become 91 88. The Legends have a potential point in the mix. As Ashley for three, he knocks it down. Looky here, the Legends are down by one. Green. Andrews, a little too much contact. Shot clock defensively for a long enough time. Forced what would have been a bad slash tough shot and even got the foul called. Here's Pledger. And he knocks it down. A three-pointer for Pledger, and he has caught fire here in the Pledger now in such a groove. He and you see this a lot. It looks like he'll never miss. Every shot he takes. Looks like it's magnetized to the basket. Corner, Miller, three ball. 
Bingo! The legends on a three-point barrage.